Good morning. I'm Travis Guillory. And I'm Corey Duke. And here are your top stories from Two Works for You. In the day ahead, the two year old girl and her mother, who were the subject of an Amber Alert overnight, are expected to return to Oklahoma. The father, accused of kidnapping them, is sitting in jail in Fort Smith, Arkansas. Muskogee police say Derek Perez was arrested just before five this morning at a motel in Fort Smith. His wife and daughter were nearby. Search crews continuing their search at two ponds in Rogers County. The FBI and the Rogers County Sheriff's Office are looking for evidence in a 2013 cold case. It's happening in an area between Ulaga and Talala, where till cadaver dogs did hit something yesterday, but further investigation is needed. And Broken Arrow City Manager will deliver his fifth State of the City address today. This will happen at the Chamber of Commerce luncheon. Several small businesses opened this past year, and the city's largest investment of retail and luxury apartments on Main Street is undergoing construction. It's expected to be completed by next year. Now let's get a check of today's forecast from meteorologist Clint Boone. Thank you, Travis and Corey. A chill in the air for us this morning. Tipters starting off in the lower 30s by lunchtime, already upper 40s and middle 50s for highs. So good looking weather this afternoon. More 50s Thursday and Friday heading in the upcoming weekend. Another cold front moves in 40s for Saturday, 30s with maybe a cold rain and then possibly some light snow heading into next Monday, guys. All right, thanks, Glenn. And thank you for tuning in to this digital news update. Keep checking back for more updates all throughout the day. And be sure to join Karen Larson and Mike Brooks tonight at 5, 6, and 10 on Two Works for You.